How are you guys doing? This is very important in reference to rare genetics and protection status and laws. Any medical person that misrepresented documentation of my teeth size, my penis size, my spinal cord, or, or my vertebrae, or any parts of my anatomy, if they switched any of my documents and tried to call me a common genetic type, they can face the death penalty. Do you understand that? My genetics is one of a kind. And some people know why. It'll be revealed later in reference to some things. Some people already know. Some people have known, like some of my girlfriends have known, that I have a very large penis and very unique... Uh, athletic ability and how fast I can run, how high I can jump, sports accomplishments, Olympic acknowledgments of things. Now these government men damaging my teeth are obviously using some other document of somebody else's teeth. The man can get the death penalty for misrepresenting my dental records and causing damage to the thickness of my teeth any swapping or switcheroo games of these people trying to belittle my identity, they can be put on trial for the death penalty. Any person trying to downgrade my anatomy size, the size of my teeth, them trying to damage my nose, them trying to steal my penis size, which is a natural large penis size, it's been documented since I was born, Everything has been documented since I was born. This man, like there's diamonds in my body, of course, that my parents had put there, which, you know, that type of information would not be passed around to certain people because then they would kidnap me and they would try to find the diamonds in parts of my body that they would try to steal. There's diamonds in my penis, too. So if they stole any of my penis, they get the death penalty. No matter what, they get put on trial for the death penalty and for physical assault and physical crimes and all their accusations. See, they accusated to try to steal my value. Do you understand that? These people in the satellite control room tried to claim that I didn't have real teeth. Or he tried to call my penis fake because they were tucking it up. They were trying to call me another person to attack me in the shower because they had tucked up the penis. And the satellites can see a penis. Satellites can see your pinky finger. The satellite can see something real small. Do you understand that? can read the date off a coin, off an American coin. It can read the date off a quarter. It can read the date off a dime. It's, it can read the date off a nickel. And it can read the date off a penny, too. Probably if it's a shiny penny, I don't know. But do you understand that? Any person switching my physical anatomy documents, some people are not privileged to certain information, like they wouldn't put it on television probably or in newspapers uh, where the location of diamonds are in my body because that's kind of like, you know, somebody would try to, they'd try to steal them then, you know. But they're not supposed to touch me in the first place. And there are people that were supposedly on security, but then they said they didn't want to be on security that they had already been paid, but they didn't want to be on security because I had a bigger penis than them. But they stole the money for security. I was supposed to have like 300 bodyguards or something. The courts even had a court document. And then they, they even got a man that's trying to impersonate me. And I guess he's got 300 bodyguards. Like he's got the same number of bodyguards that I was supposed to have had. And he's trying to steal my identity. And he has some common genetics. I have royal genetics. Do you understand that? And this government man is burning my teeth. He's obviously using the documents of some fucking German or somebody with little teeth. Both my parents had big teeth. I have big teeth. Somebody needs to find out who the satellite controller is 
and check their dental records and check to see what records they are looking at because they have been damaging my face and teeth trying to call me somebody else. It needs to be seriously detailed analyzing of these government people and their thoughts and their tricks. These people think they're funny tricking people in America. Those people need to get prosecuted for switching documents of my identity and these people using documents and trying to steal and trying to use my status for their criminal games of ripping me off and them trying to live my lifestyle and holding me hostage, trying to make me look poor. Obviously, the people that check DNA of that person obviously is in on it. What's the fingerprints of the person that's trying to steal my identity? What race, what religion, what churches do they go to? <clears throat> what synagogues had they went to? What Jewish schools did they go to? What Catholic schools did they go to? Have they ever been to the Vatican in Italy? I've been to the Vatican in Italy. Have they ever lived in France or England or Italy? Find out where this impersonator has been. See if he's been to my mother and father's property in England or Europe. See if he's been to my family property in other places. And check his fucking fingerprints and check his DNA. And find out who he is and who those security people are. Because they're probably his race. They're not my race of security. They're not people that would be security for me. Those people are probably Germans or German mixes. They're not French or Italian or Korean or Japanese or those people that are doing security for that other person. Those are people wearing disguises. Those are people that are tied in with that criminal. They're hitting me in the teeth really hard right now. All those people that are confused that are stealing my money and they're hanging out with the impersonator that's ripping me off. All of them can get prosecuted too for conspiring against me and for their illegal association with the, th the criminal that's trying to steal my identity. <clears throat>